doesn't look like your regular chess set, does it? You'd be hard-pressed to find a toy chest in America, or any country for that matter, that doesn't include a game of chess. You know the game that takes hours to play and years to learn, and that's sometimes why it stays put away. Well, a little over a year ago, Joe Micchio, who is a Glencoe firefighter, used to be a Glencoe firefighter. Glencoe used to, resident. Okay, Glencoe resident. Okay, of America Games International, came up with the idea for Quick Chess, a decidedly abbreviated version of the game, and it is this offshoot of the classic game that has many educators and chess professionals excited. They say it's a learning tool that should be used in all of our schools. Joining me now to discuss all this is Quick Chess inventor Joe Micchio, along with International Women's Chess Master Shernaz Kennedy and Port Washington School Superintendent William Hebink. And thanks to all of you for coming in. Thank you. First of all, why did you decide to take chess and change it? That would almost seem to be something sacrilegious to do. Well, it was actually accidental. Uh, I didn't really expect this to be a viable game. I designed it to teach a friend of mine and her children how to play chess. And uh, I just made it as a simple environment to show how the pieces move. Then when I played it, I was like, this thing works. I thought it would be like a tic-tac-toe and it would be easy for kids to learn on. But then when we had adults playing it, uh, and then it, one thing led to the next, and the game was like a tiger by the tail. Uh, it just exceeded every expectation I have because I don't have a very extensive chess background or any chess background at all. Now, Shanaz, the, the people who play chess very seriously, I know you're a friend of Bobby Fischer's and an international chess master yourself, really like this and say you can get a good game out of it. I think it would be really good to te as a teaching tool because when you teach kids chess, they get really scared. Oh, gosh, this is so complicated. But here they can just learn very quickly on the small board. Now, if, if the two of you can just briefly explain to us what the principles behind quick chess are. Okay. In traditional chess, you've got doubles of, of many of the right. pieces. In quick chess, you uh, have a simple looking environment. So the first thing that happens, a person looks at it and go, they say, they think, oh, that looks easy. And that's one of the first things that's uh, important for someone to learn. Yeah, it's not as intimidating looking. Right. So the next step is, well, let me try it. And they think it's easy, so they, um, they try it. And we have one of each piece. You have one rook, one bishop, and one knight, one king and queen, as usual. But in traditional chess, you've got 32 pieces, whereas in quick chess, you've got 20. On a traditional chess board, which is twice the size, you have uh, 64 squares. Here you have 30. In other words, when you open up in this game, you get right into the action. Winning is always within a, uh, a stone's throw away, and kids love to win, adults love to win. Now, and as Superintendent Hebink, I know you uh, believe in chess as a, as a teaching skill for kids in school to uh, learn how, what learning can do for you, and if you study hard, you can win, things like that. What do you like about this? Well, um, you're correct that uh, there is some nice uh, research that has come out uh, that has demonstrated that chess does uh, reinforce learning, and in fact, uh, in both uh, Pennsylvania and New York, there have been studies conducted that youngsters uh, do accelerate their learning as a result of playing chess. This allows the game of chess to be introduced during the school day. It can be inserted uh, at a quick uh, break and the youngsters can still get a game in. Uh, it allows them to uh, learn chess uh, without harming self-esteem by having to wait two and a half hours and then be disappointed at the end. How do, they, how do the kids respond to this? Because I know you have the kids in your district playing it. Uh, there's been an excellent response. Uh, we've uh, seen a real uh, spurt in chess in the district, and one of the reasons for it is really the introduction of quick chess. Do the kids then get become better students? The uh, students in Port Washington, of course, are excellent to begin with. <laughs> <laughs> but now they're we'll, super uh, we'll students. We'll assume that they're even stronger as a result. Of quick right. chess. <laughs> very interesting. Thank you very much. It, uh, I'm not so great at it, but I would even uh, get behind that board and even give it a shot. Well, thank you before very much. Before we leave, you'll have one. Okay. Thank you very much for coming in and speaking to us. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Up next, a Long Island actor who's making some movie headlines. We're going to meet him. Stay tuned. I, uh, my father. Is